Paul Ryan's new budget plan looks a lot like Paul Ryan's old budget plan. This, this to us is something that we're not going to give up on because we're not going to give up on destroying the health care system for the American people. <laughs> this, this to us is something that we're not going to give up on because we're not going to give up on destroying the health care system for the American people. Uh, the battle has begun. The battle's begun, but it's really the same battle because what Ryan is proposing is changing, replacing Medicare, the traditional Medicare plan, and that is not going to fly past the House caucus. And I yield myself uh, five minutes to discuss the implications of the uh, Ryan Republican budget uh, and uh, begin the way many of us have to say that the federal budget is a statement of priorities and values as a nation. Uh, and there's quite a contrast. So when we cut $2.7 trillion out of Medicare, is that the approach that we want to take in strengthening the safety net? Yes, we must and can steadily reduce our deficits and reduce and stabilize the debt. But we should do that in a way that immediately reduces the jobs deficit, rather than a budget that immediately makes that job deficit worse. Approach to deficit reduction that repeals subsidies for big oil, implements the Buffett rule so middle class families don't pay a higher tax rate than millionaires and billionaires, and preserves the Medicare guarantee for our seniors.